welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. This is Everyday Plus Fashion. My name is Dawn and today we're doing an Ashley Stewart haul. This is going to be one of the randomest all over the place hauls. But I feel like spring is kind of all over the place. I feel like this stuff is like showing. Um, they, they, they are all over the place. It, you know, we're talking about transitioning from winter to spring. I mean, I don't know about you, but here in Oregon, even in Huntington Beach right now, one day it's 75, the next day it's 60, the next day it's 45, the next day it's 78. So we're kind of in this weird place right now, weather-wise, and I think fashion-wise too. So this is going to be all over the place. I have everything from dresses to shorts to a bathing suit. Please say some prayers for me. I'm not even Catholic. But, um, so, now, I like I've said before, I'm an occasion dresser. So when I'm buying things, I'm always kind of thinking about what could I use this for? What thing do I have coming up? And so I've talked about it 80,000 times that I have a uh, cruise to Alaska in May. Well, at first I just bought, like, cardigans and shirts to go under with jeans. And I thought I would just be very wintry. And then I decided that, well, you know, just because it's winter, I mean, just because it's Alaska, maybe they could, I could still wear springy colored clothes. So I'm starting to like look into some different things that are kind of maybe brighter colors, but are still warm and maybe just a little more fun than just a basic black cardigan with a shirt under it. So this, oh, first of all, I want to say something about Ashley Stewart. Um, I think my third video I ever did was Ashley Stewart, I believe. And I got to tell you, I had never tried them before. I would go on their website every once in a while, like it would pop up on my Facebook or my Instagram or something. And I would look at it and I just kind of thought, I'm not the woman that they're targeting. You know, a lot of these were body conscious dresses, like body con dresses or work attire. So I just kind of like would look at the company and I just leave. Well, in doing this, you know, doing this YouTube thing, I've been like looking really hard at like all these different brands that have especially the brands that I don't usually buy from. And I saw that if I looked through Ashley Stewart, I could find the most amazing clothes, the most unique. I just think that the stuff that they have is very different and very kind of nothing I'd ever seen before. So I bought a few pieces and it's like, I, like I said, it's going to be the most random haul that you've ever seen. This is not like, I can't put this into one category. So it's just going to be an Ashley Stewart haul. So the first thing I saw was this absolutely adorable cardigan, long cardigan, uh, not super long, you know, I mean, it's like knee, knee length, but I, I love me a hood. If it has a hood, I am all about the hood. Um, I thought this was so cute. Now I realized when I put this on, that these two blues don't really match. I'm thinking this is black, so I'll probably just put it with a black shirt. And, um, but I thought for Alaska, this would be super cute because most, most likely it's going to be like fifties and sixties. So I feel like if I had a long sleeve black t-shirt on and I had this on that if I didn't need, I might not even need a jacket. And if I did, I could just put a jacket over it. But, um, I just thought this was super cute. It's kind of off white. It has black. This, I love to find a shirt, this, this limey green and this like royal blue color. And it's super cute. I thought it'd be cute for that. And I also think sometimes it's not warm right now, at least in where I live. So this would actually be either at night or even like today, it's like rainy and cloudy. So, you know, it would be a nice for that. I forgot I wanted to, I really wanted to make sure I told you guys prices and that kind of stuff. Um, I'm guessing this is the hooded. No, that's not it. Put it here it is, white. I bought this in an 1820. That's the one thing about Ashley Stewart is I've had a really good luck with 1820s. Um, the 1416 is, I'm like right on the cusp of the biggest part of the 16. Um, like I have a 39 and a half, 40 inch waist. The 16 goes to like a 39 inch waist and then the 18 is like a 40 inch waist. So I'm right in the middle. So I kind of err on the side of going up instead of if this is meant for a 14, and a 16, I might not be able to do it. So, so far I've had pretty good luck with it. So this is uh, an 1820 and I got this, it cost me $34.65. I feel like my lipstick completely clashes with this. Okay, 
I don't know what to say about this, except for I don't know why, but I love it. I don't know if my inner 90s person that used to wear like the little windbreaker sweat outfits is coming through, but this is so different. Like what I was saying about being different. So this is, I, I can't say anything else, but these are parachute pants. These are parachute pants. They have zippers all over them. They are shiny. It makes quite a bit of noise when you walk. It's got this, ooh, some ASMR for you. Um, it definitely makes some noise when you walk. It looks a little like a ski outfit. I, I, a little bit like a ski outfit. So now I don't, the, if you notice, the pants are a little bit too genie for me. So I was messing with these and I think if I tuck the elastic under and then pull it down, I think I like the look of that better. It just kind of drops right at my foot. You guys can see that. Hopefully you can see that. Um, okay, so let's go over this. This is high-waisted pants. These again in the 1820. I got these in. Zipper pockets right here. Cute. Um, I'd almost almost leave them open maybe. I don't know, but you know me in pockets. I don't like that's a place where things can escape to. It gives them freedom. Um, let's see. Can look at the back. Um, it's, you know, it's a shiny, like, windbreakery type material. But look at this jacket. This jacket is freaking adorable. Okay, so we got, like, pockets. We got zippers. We got the nothing on this one. We got uh, a zipper pocket here. We got another zipper pocket here. Okay, so this is how it like zips up. So we have a zip up here, and then it buttons. So, and this is an 1820. I probably could have got away with the 1416. It's a little bit generous. The pants, I don't think so, because I wouldn't want these. There is no stretch at all in these. It is a windbreaker type material. So, um, but isn't that cute? I wish there was pockets right here, but there's not. But I just think this is so cute. It's so my like Barbie. I kind of want to wear it with my white booties. I feel like it's so like Beverly Hills Housewife. Does anybody watch Housewives? If you watch Housewives, <laughs> comment below so we can talk a little bit about Housewives on the channel. I'm obsessed with Housewives. I actually, uh, a friend of mine was one of the Orange County. Kind of Does Scam Likely call you as much as Scam Likely calls me? I wish he would just leave me alone. Okay, um, <laughs> they're all about like their Versace and their Chanel and their Fendi and all this stuff. They wear like the sweat outfits and stuff and then they wear like these kind of boots with it. I thought, oh my God, that would be, no, I, I probably, I couldn't do this. Though. I'm not, I can't pull this off, I don't think. But I could pull off some cute white, I actually have some like high top white tennis shoes, which I thought, oh my God, seriously, too much. So, but it's like, okay, so, can I wear this to Alaska? Can I be like on a glacier uh, and be like, ah, look at me. Uh, yes, I'm styling on a glacier. So I don't know, I kind of want to. Cause I could just wear like a white t-shirt under this and then tie it around my waist if it gets warm or put another jacket on top of it. Um, it doesn't have a hood, I don't think. Oh, it does have a hood, it has a hood? Okay, come on. This is just made for Alaska, don't you think? And just to like be make people look at me and go, she wearing a ski outfit? What is she wearing? Anyway, Ashley Stewart, I love this. Uh, so again, I got these both in an 1820, 34 to 65 for each of these pieces. So I know I know they were having some kind of sale. Um, yeah, they were having some kind of sale. So anyway, because I think this is a lot, obviously a lot more normally. So ah, I just love it. Okay, now I think we're I think we're inching into summer now, or spring-ish, summer-ish. First, we're gonna go spring, and then we'll go summer. How's that? Okay. The next thing I have to show you is these white pants. Nothing worse than white pants on film. You don't have any idea. <laughs> if you cannot do it, I would recommend it because it's um, incredibly humbling. So these were just, I'm guessing a straight leg white pant. I'm always looking for a white pant. These are those stretchy, really stretchy pants. I bought these in 18. They definitely are big. They're, they're big, but I want, I like white pants that are big. The problem is I don't really like the legs on these. Are these a straight leg? I thought I could roll them up maybe to make them look a little more like a boyfriend. I don't know, but um, they're okay. I, they're not on my invoice, so I don't know if they came separate or something, 
I don't remember, but they're $39 on the tag. Uh, I am so sweaty, you guys have no idea how much of a workout this is, or this how much effort it is to try stuff on. It's hot, I just turned my air conditioner on to like 65, because it was so hot. But anyway, I just put it with this jacket, because I thought, you know, if I don't do the pants with the, the whole outfit, I could definitely still just do the jacket, even with some jeans, just to brighten stuff up a little bit. But anyway, these are the white pants, more of a straight leg, I'm guessing, and um, I don't know, I don't like the pants. Okay, so this is the next thing, and you know, at first glance, I was like, oh, this is really cute, I really like this. I'm gonna wrap a little bit. Um, the color is fabulous, like ridiculously fabulous. Now, I will say it's kind of a scuba. It's not a true scuba. It's a little bit lighter weight than a scuba. I don't know if you can tell. I don't know if you can even tell what the fabric is on this, but it's like a very heavy knit, but uh, I don't know. Anyway. So I, at first glance, I'm like, oh my gosh, this is so cute. Look at the cute flowy skirt. Oh, it's adorable. <sighs> then I started having problems with it. I mean, I do like the arms for me. You know, I'm just trying to always cover my arms. So this to me is a good arm. I like this. I, the, this is the problem though. I think it thought I should have bigger boobs. I did get this in a 2X. So this is a 2X. But, okay, if you see, if I pull this down so that this doesn't have wrinkles, it is below my natural waist and not flattering at all. It is like right here on like one of my widest parts of my body. But if I put it up where it looks better on my waist, it's got this extra stuff right here that I think it thinks I should have boobs. <laughs> Which, they're, it's not alone. I, I think I should have boobs too. And so I don't know. It's like my belly line's a little bit there. I could probably just wear some real lightweight shapewear and I think that it would show. It's so. I'm kind of torn. Maybe I'll like stuff my bra with something. Or maybe I do have like some super padded bras. Like my bra right now today is like not padded at all. So maybe if I had like a padded, a uh, big padded bra would work. I don't know. I'm not counting it out yet. But anyway, so I bought this in a 2X. I paid $41.65 for it. I just love the color. It's beautiful. This is probably my favorite color. White and this and pink maybe. I don't know. So, I don't know. We'll have to see. I'll look on the video, too, to see how horrible it looks. Because I see it right now, all I see is this wrinkly mess right here. So, okay. Let's keep going. Okay, so the next thing I have to do before... I know I saw the same dress on. Wait, what happened? Um, I'm going to try a on right now. And i got to tell you, I'm a little nervous about it. Try not to uh, get in my head about it too much that this is gonna be somewhere that anybody that I know can see. And um, anyway, I just, and I don't know what it is. I, I go in my pool with my friends here and it's not a big deal. I go on vacation with my friends, like girls trips and stuff I'm wearing a bathing suit, but I don't know, just something about having it right here. And I'm not tan. Somehow, I mean, I don't care what you say, fat looks better tan. My cellulite does not look as bad <laughs> as it does when it's white. So anyway, but I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna be brave, brave. I'm gonna channel my inner, Sarah Ray Vargas and glitters and lasers and all you guys that but that just rock it and I go yes that looks so good on you okay so here it is so this is a top <laughs> like I mean it's like I'm getting in the water I'm gonna ease myself back um this is the top okay first of all a top that doesn't show my arms in a bathing suit let's go let's do this you know I'm here for it as they say um the color again same colors that dress love 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 it um, now I will tell you that I buy my bathing suits large -er. like these are both 3x because I don't like it to be I don't need anything cutting into my skin and making an obviously more de defined role I have enough of my own I just like it to feel very smooth and comfortable which but sometimes a lot of stuff is really super baggy and looks really like weird so I have to like kind of like decide what's more important to me sometimes. But um, like towards bathing suits, I've tried to wear towards bathing suits. And to get my size, first of all, it expects that I have like triple D boobs. And um, also it, they're so tight that I feel like it just shows a lot of rolls and bumps and stuff. So anyway, I saw this one I thought this might be cute. So here we go. Here is the whole thing. I do like that only like this, this much of my belly shows, not a lot. It's got this little cage side which I love. Here's the back, full coverage back. You know, I've gotten some ones lately that are kind of cheeky. Not okay with that. 
Um, I'm not, I'm not okay with it, but it just certain things, certain places. I think this is a very kind of modest two-piece bathing suit. I feel like, you know, my belly line, and now it is a little bit baggy, like in the crotch, a little bit baggy here. Um, you know, I could probably pull it up a little bit more, but um, I'm not really prepared to do that on camera without looking at it first. Um, the belly line doesn't look too bad. I mean, it's there. There's nothing I do. I have a belly. So that's not going to be, but I thought, gosh, if I had a little bit of a tan or even do a self tan or a spray tan, that this would look amazing. And we will, I will bring a bathing suit on my Alaska cruise for like the hot tub and like in the spa, there's like a pool thing. Oh, so let me show you the, oh, let me show you the back. So, so this is the under. So if you see, it's just, it has little, it's cut, it has cups in it. So if you probably, if you didn't need them, you wouldn't, I mean, the support for me is fine. I don't know. You know, you big, you know, big booby girls. Oh no, you know, I don't know if this has enough support. I never, it's so funny when people talk about that, I'm always like, I never have to worry about that. But I do have to worry about it usually being baggy. And this would be the 3X is not. So I'm actually really glad I got the 3X. I feel like it's not cutting me right here. It's not cutting me like, I mean, I've had some of these where they were so small, like, you know, little things came out, like a little bulges out of each of my, the cage things. And I, I'm not, a, some people you know, rock it. I can tell you, I've never looked at somebody on the internet with their things like that going, oh gosh, could, how do they wear that? No, I'm like, that's amazing. But I just personally feel comfortable with something different. I just want it to be kind of as smooth as I can get it. Anyway, that's just who I am. But look at that, a bathing suit that covers up my um, arms. So I really like it. So now, what I'm going to do now is just kind of stay in this and show you these super cute cover-ups that I got. And this is very... Um, Maybe Ashley Stewart is just very uh, Beverly Hills housewife. I don't know because they kind of wear these like embellished stuff sometimes. Sometimes like Orange County does that too. Um, anyway, um, so this is just, I thought this would be perfect. Perfect cover up to go with this bathing suit. I am going to do, when it gets closer to summer, I'm going to do how to style. I, I've learned a lot how to style a bathing suit, like kind of where you feel comfortable. Um, because I go on cruises a lot and when you get to port, you're like in your bathing suit and cover up, but you know, also there's chub bra because you're gonna be walking around a lot. So I've kind of like learned some ways of doing that. Okay. I will figure this out at some point. Oh, here we go. Okay. So basically it's kind of weird that the tie is in the back. Um, but I get it cause it would cover all this up, I guess. So anyway, so you would just tie this in the back. So it kind of gives you a waist, which for a cover-up, that's pretty nice. Sleeves are good, lightweight, kind of probably rayon polyester kind of fabric. Um, I uh, Anyway, let me show you the back before I see. So basically, this kind of goes through these like kimono sleeves. You know how that has that extra little flap? I don't know what that's called. I think it's, this is a true kimono style. But um, so you can tie that as tight or as loose as you want. Then I will show you. The colors are gorgeous. It's got these like, you know, little fake turquoisey things and some like silver embellished stuff. It's got some royal blue in it. So if I did get a royal blue swimsuit, this would also be good for that. It also has some black. If you notice in the in here, there's little black speckles. So it'd be cute with black also. Um, it's cute. Yeah, it's got a, like a black line down the middle. So it's super cute. So so I'm gonna stay, I'm gonna I have one more cover up which Ah, uh, it's the best. <laughs> so here we go. <laughs> you can watch me get in it. Okay, I saw this on there and I was like, okay, that's a cover up. Well, I guess it has to be a cover up because, well, I mean, I guess you, unless you want to wear your lingerie under it or cute bra or something. Um, it's just like a really stretch stretchy mesh kind of thing again with these trying to button see these but you guys have these you know, you're crazy like this elastic thing right here this is a little stretcher the one from torrid i could not get it on um let's see do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Woo! Okay, I did it! <laughs> so anyway, so this is just maybe like the most comfortable thing on the planet. 
may be the cutest thing on the planet. You know, it's like you have your bathing suit on, you're covered up. But this is, I mean, this is the lightest weight. Like, I don't even know what to what to compare this to. It is stretchy. It's literally see-through. Can you see me? It's seriously light colored. It's yellow, which I think, look, it kind of took on a green because I put it with this aqua. Um, it's got kind of a genie leg to it. It's very flowy and big, and then it's kind of tight at the bottom, so it's not going to be like floating on the ground. This I paid. This was a 2X, and I paid $34.65 for this. And you know, I mean, yeah, I probably could have sized down, but I just love this. I love the way the arms flow. I will use this a lot in the summer when I want to just, especially on a cruise, when you're just like walking around, you want your, you know, you have your bathing suit on, but you, you're walking here and there, you're walking to somewhere, or you're in port. Like, it's just a little bit more of a cover-up, and I just think this is adorable. I think I have one more thing for you, another summer thing. So we're going to stay in summer. Okay, so the model in the actual thing that I clicked was wearing this outfit. And I was like, I need to have that outfit. I love tropical anything. When it gets closer to summer, you'll learn this about me. Um, we've gone to the Caribbean and the Bahamas multiple times. And Hawaii multiple times. I, I live for white sand, clear blue water that's warm. I live literally, I mean, not even happy place. It is like heaven it is like i could just stay there forever and i would be perfectly content if i never was given anything or did anything else if i could just lay in that water all day in the warm sun oh it's the best so anyway so i digress as i <sighs> wish i was there so anyway so i bought so i thought of this outfit now this limey green shirt it's very limey green i didn't realize how limey green it was when i bought it it's super cute it's kind of weirdly itchy, and I don't know how, it's like a, it looks like it's open, like it's an open mesh, but it's not. It's actually, the clear uh, boxes are actually like fabric. So it's almost like this is almost overlaid over a mesh fabric. Um, I, this is just, I don't know, this, the thing right here is a little bit stretchy. I mean, a little bit itchy. Um, I do love it though. This is kind of my, like, you know, I keep saying, this is my color, this is my color. Spring is my colors. But if you notice, my pillows, my uh, frames, what are those called? They're called something. Anyway, uh, those, and then literally, I don't know if you guys can see this door out here. Oh, you probably can't see it. Anyway, my front door is this color. My house is gray with black shutters and white trim, and then this is the color of my door. So I'm obsessed, like my whole like scheme like is this in black and white. So um, I love it. Anyway, so it's cute, it's cute. I'm, I'm still on the fence about whether I would keep it or not. Um, and the shorts are way too big. The shorts are super cute, perfect length. I mean, adorable little Bermuda shorts, but they are huge and I can't, oh, I was gonna, it must have, I must have had a different, another page of my, um, oh, I can't take this off, so. Yeah, see, these are 1820, and it's stuff like this where it's like, I really should be minus 16, where, like, the pink little wig windbreaker outfit, those pants were very high-waisted, and I knew they didn't be stretching them, so that's why I got the 18 in those or the 1820 in those. I was glad I did. But these are, I mean, I think they would be a lot more flattering, and I think they would be a lot cuter, but they are dang comfortable and um, super cute. I will probably either exchange these for the smaller size because they're just kind of me. They're kind of what I, I love this. And to me, even this with like a black bikini top and then like a little, uh, even this over it or like a white, just like open shirt. Ugh, so cute. So anyway, so I love these. Okay, so see, do you see what I'm saying that like Ashley Stewart has some real, you know, and, and by the way, this is not sponsored, which all you have to do is look at how many subscribers I have and realize it's not sponsored. But I just want, I mean, I have kind of fallen in love with Ashley Stewart. I've kind of fallen in love with the fact that I might sometimes have to search a little bit harder because I'm not working or I'm not going to the club or, you know, a lot of this stuff is just a little too fancy for me. But the stuff I got today is wonderful and I would wear all of it. And it just took me like a second to find some of it. But so I would suggest just keep looking on there and wait for a sale because the stuff can be a little bit pricey. I mean, it's a little bit higher end and it could be a little pricier, but you, 
there's sales all the time, 30, 40% off sales. And so just keep looking and you can get some really, really cute stuff, especially for spring, very colorful and fun. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Thanks so much for watching and see that little red button down there? Click it, click it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Click it right now. Okay, please. <laughs> All right, love you guys, thanks.